temperature inversion is an important concept to understand the impact of temperature on cell delays in our design. So on older technology nodes, with an increase in the temperature, we saw that the delay of the transistors also increased. And this was because at higher temperatures, the kinetic energy of the charge carriers was high, which resulted in more collisions between the charge carriers, which resulted in a decrease in the mobility of the carriers, which in turn caused the increase in the cell delays. So at higher temperatures, our transistors were slower. So for setup timing analysis, our worst timing corner was more likely to be at a higher temperature like 100 degrees Celsius or 125 degrees Celsius, etc. But this temperature dependence is slightly different on new technology nodes, especially when we move to below 20 nanometers or in modern designs where almost all companies are working under 10 nanometer. So on lower technology nodes, as the temperature is increased, we see two things happening. The first is the mobility degradation as usual, but we also see that the threshold voltage of the transistors is decreasing and is the more dominating factor when temperature increases. And because of this being the dominating factor, we see that the transistor delays are decreasing as the temperature is increasing, which means that at higher temperature, we can have faster transistors. So in such a case, for setup timing analysis, our worst or slowest timing corner could be at a low temperature like 0 degree Celsius or minus 25 degree Celsius. And our hold corner or the fast timing corner could be at a higher temperature like 0 degree Celsius or 125 degree Celsius. Note that it is still possible to have the higher temperature corner as the worst setup corner even in lower tech nodes. 